third time's the charm. So uh, uh, it was just our night. You know, I'm glad we pulled out, you know, this close one. Uh, Penn State played hard. And like I said, I'm just so proud of everybody, you know, for just sticking with it. So. I was very confident, um, especially I knew either JJ would get the shot or me. And, um, I mean, I definitely got confidence in him. And he definitely knocked it down. He'd been on fire all night. So um, it was definitely a great play at the end of one. He kept it the same. Uh, pretty much it's, you know, the Eton, you know, sets that up screen. And uh, pretty much I just play off of how the guys guard me. And, uh, you know, he kind of went to the inside, and I popped to the outside. And uh, Rhino found me and uh, knocked it down. Were you surprised? I mean, you looked like, you know, split side, you were pretty open. Were you surprised that you were that open? Um, I mean, Etwan, he set a really good screen, and uh, you know, he he got me open, and uh, I was just fortunate enough to hit the shot. You're in a sticky situation because you can't um, you can't coach both teams. You know, you can't control what they do, and so then obviously when you you call something, and um, it was a simple play, but there's a couple different reads to the play, and obviously they did a good job um, of making the second cut and the second screen. And Juwan got a you know a rhythm jump shot and knocked it down, but um, there's also you know they can they can do a lot of different things there defensively that you, when you don't have any timeouts you really can't adjust to it. You try to talk about it. You try to talk about um, adjusting if they change defenses or change a look. And um, our guys did a good job of executing. You have to give them credit. And were you surprised that Johnson got such an open look? Uh, well, I, I think you know we made. The second cut, the second screen, you know, we didn't feel like we were going to get something off that first action. We thought we were going to have to, you know, get um, a screen and rescreen. And, you know, it's the thing that's difficult is, you know, he's 6'10", he's long and athletic. Big guys aren't usually used to run, chasing guys off screen. They're the guys showing on screens. And so when you have a guy like that and you move him in and out, I, I just think he's a tough guard. And then he's got such a high release point, um, it's tough to get to once he